we kicked off today's event with a donation of over 99,000 pounds of food from our partners that will help fight food insecurity right in our own Bronx neighborhood. We see the need on our end, and that's why we are so uh, focused on being able to, to participate and every year try to increase what we do. By hosting a food drive, Yankee fans have a place to go, and we're so appreciative of their support. We're happy to give them vouchers to a game next season. I'm just very happy to be here. Food drive is a win-win for everybody involved, so uh, it's a great day in the Bronx. It's a great event, and I'm happy to be here. During the holidays, we people needing so much stuff, especially in the Bronx. And being able to see the actual people come in and donate and participate also, like today, there's no words to be able to describe that during the holidays, right? I mean, it just, it's amazing to be able to be a part of that. You know, food drives are, are, are immensely important for, for people in need um, and people who don't have access to food. So uh, with the Yankees' reach, bring a lot of food. It's a wonderful cause. I'm happy to be here. That was a quick look at the Yankees 28th holiday food drive held on Wednesday, an event presented in conjunction with Seatown and Bravo Supermarkets along with Crasdale Foods. It's good to have you back on Hot Stove. Good to see what the Yankees always do in the community. Now